here Welcome to the Villa family Hello guys, welcome back to our channel Hope everyone is alright because I'm good This is why I'm here to talk with you guys here yeah? And um, my name is Elena like most of you guys know already yeah like i said today i need to come here and explain to you guys a little bit more about the last video that i post here yeah? and this time i'm with the tissue because last video was so embarrassing i need to say uh, sorry to you guys here yeah, that i was repeating so much the, the words that i was saying i should go straight away to say what i was, was supposed to say but um, i didn't because uh, I should work on the video but it was really hard all the time when I go to to work on the video I was like a little bit down I was crying yeah and it was a little bit yeah and my daughters they was laughing they said mom how are you gonna make the video and you put the the happy song on, on the video why mom why I don't know where I was with my head on this day yeah? but okay let's go why oh, oh, with what I came here to say just because I said about the situation that we are living doesn't mean that our channel is going to be just about the this name, this disease on this channel, yeah? It's going to be a lot of good stuff as well. And today I'm going to say to you guys, like you guys already know, yeah? When cancer knock you, didn't, came, didn't knock your door, I just came without knocking. Knock your door, yeah? Today, I'm gonna say to you guys what you guys heard on the TV. When you guys heard on the TV, cancer, someone died with the cancer, and you guys watch movies with the cancer, all of this kind of stuff here. Yeah. But you never thought that this is gonna happen on your family. This word cancer never come to your family, on your house. Yes. I've never thought that I'm gonna have this on my house, never. But in, on 13 of December 2018, I received this news. When I received this news, my life changed forever. Changed forever. Most of the sad days on my house, on my family. The Christmas is gonna come, and I have people that's gonna come to our house. Christmas is my my favorite holiday ever. Yeah, I love Christmas so much, so much. And when I received this news, I was really down. We all was down. We was all down. Jean, when they said Jean have a bowel cancer, bowel cancer. Yeah, I don't know how to pronounce this properly. Bowel cancer. Yeah, you have a bowel cancer. I couldn't believe. I couldn't believe. <sighs> My life changed completely, yeah? And uh, my kids, us, my daughter, she was at, uh, at the uh, college, yeah? She was feeling the college. She was like, she have like a good uh, grades to go to any uni that she wished to go. But when she started, she was supposed to go to the interview to Cambridge, yeah? She was supposed to go to the Cam Cambridge interview but the day that she was supposed to go to the interview, she was really down. Well, this is when we received the news that uh, they have cancer. She couldn't believe my Jessica. She couldn't believe. She passed her exam with a lot, with uh, good grades, but she was really down. But she passed with a lot of good grades. But she didn't go to the Cambridge yet because she was, she didn't pass the interview because she was really down. But she was she have a great school to Cambridge, yeah. But what I want to say to you guys, and um, and I have nieces that come to the to have a Christmas with us on the in December. She bought the ticket in one year in, a, in advance to come to stay with us, and I have my uncle that wanna come to stay with us on Christmas. And I said, oh my God, what I'm going to do? We have Christmas is our favorite holiday. We didn't say to the little ones about what's happening, yeah. But uh, what's gonna happen? We cannot say to the people that uh, this situation, and we don't know what what's happened, which stage is with the cancer. We don't know nothing yet. And I said, okay. Ishan said, we don't gonna cancel Christmas. 
we gonna we don't gonna say to anyone we gonna have a good christmas yeah okay how we gonna have a good christmas and you know that your husband have cancer everyone when when receive the this news they're gonna think like oh you're gonna die you're gonna die cancer everyone gonna think like just because you have cancer you're gonna die next time ne next next tuesday next monday next no i was thinking like this yeah i said no my husband don't gonna die no 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 he cannot die no and we didn't cancel the christmas 21 everyone came to our house the house was full of people we were showing that we are happy and uh, we we eat we dance we do everything when i go upstairs it's my time to cry it's my time to hug my husband it's my time that my big daughters they come to our home they hug us and they said everything's gonna be fine mama dead everything's gonna be fine my two daughters the big ones oh my god i just i say thank you to god that uh, god gave me four gifts four four five with my husband as well five gifts in my life that uh, I, I need to be grateful for uh, for the rest of my life because it's the best the best of the best but my kids my family yeah? because the situation that we was living they was there for us all the time Katarina and Jessica they was there they said mom and dad you guys are very strong they know the love that we have to each other the way I love Jean the way Jean loved me I don't know guys um, the same, when the all the parts everything is finished the we go to the, another appointment and the doctor said oh you have uh, the cancer is not just on the bowel, it's on the liver as well. I said, oh my God, I cannot believe on that. The cancer, we just found out that you have a cancer. Now the cancer is, ju is not only just on one part, it's another part as well. Oh my God, what's gonna happen? What? Okay, next next appointment is to, to find out which stage of cancer you have. And me and my daughter was doing some research you have the cancer on the bowel, they can do operation and they can remove the other one as well on the, on the liver. And the, the month, and then we found out, we go to the appointment, another appointment, and uh, they said, you have another on the lung, everything in 2019, and it's a stage four stage four guys you found out that your husband have cancer now you found out that your husband is a stage four what a nonsense this is a nonsense he was happy so happy you we go to the holiday together and we came he was feeling a little bit of pain and we go to the hospital and they give you this news and now they're gonna say to you that he's a stage four what where this came from no no where this came from? I said, this is not true, what they say in there. No, I was talking with God. I said, God, what is this? I know that God gave the, this kind of, I don't know how to pronounce this, I'll give this to the people that they know that uh, can handle this, yeah. And I never ask God why, 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 never. I never gonna ask because God know the, why the things happen on the people's life. God know. If God give this, God know the reason why. God know. And I never gonna com complain with God this and that, no. Because God helped me so much. God helped me so much, guys. God is everything in my life. Since I came to this country, God helped me so much, so much. And this situation, God still helped me so much because when you receive this news in stage four, this means that people can disappear like they don't gonna be forever with, they don't gonna be like, they, gonna, they don't gonna last on your life. But God help, it's gonna be three years that we are on the road. And we truly believe that we're gonna be on the road for more, more years. I don't mind, but I'm gonna have my husband next to me. My husband will be next to me. 
you're gonna be next to me yes stage four we done the one operation they didn't do the same operation to remove the the, the, the liver the first they done the operation on the the bowel yeah and um, yeah they done the operation on the bowel then they got they done another operation on to the liver and he was doing the chemo he doing the chemo and uh, yes then covid came they stopped with the with the treatment then they came more on the liver then they start with the radio on the bowel came another again on the bowel then they start with the um, radiotherapy and because they stopped with the with the with the chemo came more yes this is only what i said to you guys okay guys i don't i believe i said everything where it was the cancer i believe i'm gonna leave some some pictures here for you guys to see some clips here for you guys to see it's not easy but i want to say thank you to everyone that reply that give us love because this was very important for us when i post the video how many people watch the video how many people like the video how many people give us love thank you guys thank you because this make us to be strong and have more faith that everything is possible, everything um, is in God's hand, everything's gonna be, be good. Yeah. Thank you for all the prayers. Because one time I was reading the Bible, and the Bible said, like, we need to be united, yeah? United. Now, we have a lot of people that love us, this is why I said, no, it's time for me to speak, and more prayers better for us. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you for the love, for the prayers, for everything. Continue to pray because, like I said, I don't want to say that much, but where the cancer came is a little bit complicated. Yeah. This one is down, very down, very down. John, now, before I was have like the help him to don't think. We make videos, we have love, we love so much make our videos. But the sense you receive the, the another news is like proper down. It's so down. And I don't like to see him like this, yeah. He don't want to leave his room. My husband. My boy that you guys see him all happy. When we see him is moving. Yeah. Yeah. But everything's gonna be fine. Okay guys. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for the love and support, yeah? And thank you to watch this video because this is very important for us. Very important, okay guys? Thank you so much. Thank you for all the love. Thank you. What? Mm -hmm. oh, it's talking too much. That's why I'm gonna stop now. You don't gonna say anything. Hmm? You wanna like to talk? Hmm? Yeah? Hmm? You wanna Alex to talk with you? No. Why not? Why not? Not now. <laughs> Fala, amor. Fala. Então, do que falar? Olha, os aviões estão tão altos.
Yeah. 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 Yeah.